Yeah, it's Lydia and Nam again. Please do some stuff. Alternative British Transport Police on 61016. That's 61016. See it, say it.
just gonna share with you what happened during um, the VIP photo taking session with Crush and Milik. So, where do I start? Like, okay, so when I went there, I was the only one I know who was going. I had no friends or whatever. But like in the queue, I met these two other girls, Nina and Roxana, who were super sweet and like, we decided to like be in groups together because apparently you have to be in groups of five in order to take a photo with both Milik and Crush. So then, yeah, we just like teamed up because like all the three of us were alone anyway. So yeah, that's what we did. Yeah, so like we waited in the queue for a while. It was super cold and my fingers were freezing. But there were really nice people around. Like some girls gave out banners. And other girls, this other girl, she gave out like photo cards. Let me show you the photo card I got. It's this cute photo card. So cute. Oh. Alright, yeah. So yeah, that happened. And then when we went in, we were still struggling to get a group of five because like we needed two, two other persons to, to join. So then we like, we kept looking around, see if there's any like a pair of uh, girls um, who were free, you know, and like just nice. Um, Nina found these two girls and yeah, so we had a group of five and like everybody, the two girls were super sweet. And yeah, so like we all discussed like what kind of poses you want to do and everybody was just like oh, I don't know, I don't know, we just like do this <laughs> That's like your default pose is We had to like queue in the foyer I think And then Crush and Milik were on the second level And we were just sneaking around and going up So then we went up on the stairs to go to the room where they had that photo booth set up and yeah, it was so surreal because like I could see Crush at the corner of my eye and I could see Milik as well But it's like, it's not hitting me like they're there, they're real When we went there, had to like we were we had to like put our belongings one side And then like there was this like station for people to put their gifts for Crush on Milik And I had a gift for Crush, it was a shirt printed with um, Do You's face Do You is his pet dog that he freaking loves and they're so cute together so I printed it out <laughs> and I wore the same shirt, so we have we have couple shirts. <laughs> but yeah, it was just for fun. And then Crush and Millie was just standing there, like two of them. They're so cute. And um Crush is like my height. Those who know me, I'm like 169 six, one, six, cm. And I'm I'm tall but I'm not that tall. And Crush is like plus minus like three or five cm taller than me. And he's damn cute. <laughs> so I was the first one to go go towards them so that I could choose like to stand where. And obviously I chose to stand beside Crush. <laughs> so like it was um it was me, it was Crush, and then it was Milik. And the other girls were just in front. And then yeah, and then like while waiting for the photographer to like um set up his um camera and, and whatnot, we shook hands and like hi, hi, um thanks for coming, blah blah blah. <laughs> I like couldn't think because like you know I, I was I already planned like what I wanted to say like in English and in Korean but like when I was there I was like they're real yeah so then when I, I was just like hi and you hello and like shook his hand and then um yeah while well, waiting for the photographer I was like oh yeah I had to show him my shirt so then I was just like I turned to my left he was standing to my left I turned to my left and I just like poked him on his shoulder and then he turned. And then and I was like, duh. <laughs> uh, do you? And then he was like, wow. <laughs> nice. I'm like, yeah, thanks. And then it's like, the photographer is really unique. So then we took like um, uh, three photographs, I think. Three or four, I'm not sure. I can't remember. But yeah, that's quite a lot, to be honest. And then um, obviously you have to change poses. So the first one I did was like this. It's not wrong. Not like this. It's not wrong. And then the second one, I did that in front, like that on like Crush's head, so it's like just like that. And then the third one, I think I just, I just did this. It was just like, you just couldn't think, you know. It's like, it's like a neoprene booth. You have to like. I hope they turn out good. I hope my face is not oily, and I hope that Crush is cute, and like the poses are not cringy, you know. Uh, yeah. So. So this is the first photo that was posted. He's so cute. Everybody's so cute. 
And then there's the next one. I told you he was like similar height as me. <laughs> that was done. Like the crew just had to like bring us out. And then he was like, oh hi, thank you, thank you. And then like I personally went to me because like he was very sad. Like standing by himself alone there. Like everybody obviously went to crash. So then I just went to Milik and I was like, hi Milik, thank you for coming. And like I shake his head. Yeah, and then yeah, that's it. It was pretty fast actually. And yeah, I was like, thank you, Samida. <laughs> yeah, that was so cool. The VIP experience and the concert started and like everything was like super lit and fun and crush was so funny and dumb. <laughs> he's damn cute though. I freaking love him. He's so dumb and so extra, but I freaking love him. His vocals is oh, amazing. And yeah, it was so worth it. Like I'm so happy I went because like he's really a he's a really a singer that I really really love, and it's been forever since like he ever come to any places that I have ever lived. Yeah, so yeah, that was my crush and Milik VIP concert experience in London. <laughs>